Hello. Welcome to my 31 Days of Horror Movie Reviews. Day... Nine? Okay. So, today I will be reviewing one of my favorites called Wishmaster by Wes Craven. Okay, it is directed by Robert Kurt Kurtzman. Written by Peter Atkins, starring Tammy Lauren, Andrew Divoff, Chris Lemon, Wendy Benson, Tony Crane, Ginny O'Hara, O'Hara, Kane Hodder, Jason, and Hatchet, and others, Tony Todd, Tony Man, and Robert England, Friday, and. It's narrated by Angus Scrim, Wish, or not Wishmaster, a uh, prophet, uh, what is it, Angus Scrim, Angus Scrim, I know he's done something, uh, Angus Scrim, something to do with the tall man, oh, it'll come back to me, <laughs> and the music is done by Harry Manfredini and it, the production company was Pierre David distributed by Live Entertainment and released on September 19th 1997 and so basically this movie is about an ancient creep monster demon called a djinn that grants wishes and once it grants your wish it takes your soul well wishes because I think it's, yeah, it's three wishes so he takes your soul and once he gets enough souls he can unleash his world onto ours and so Basically, the film opens up in the ancient world, and basically the jinn is creating havoc and chaos in the world. People are dying or getting their wishes granted. <laughs> And so this wizard or sorcerer traps the djinn inside this red ruby. Fast forward to present day America and uh, let's see, an, art an ancient artifact that had that ruby in it is found after a freak accident after a, a crane is a crate is dropped onto the one of the supervisors of the crew so this construction worker or worker finds it and he sells it to a pawn shop and This uh, lady finds it, and he and she sells or she asks this science science guy or teacher to examine it, and doing that because he was using some kind of laser to look into it causes an explosion which releases the djinn and this, the guy who the scientist who was studying it he's dying and he basically gets killed because he's because the djinn was like do you wish for the pain to stop And so, 
he dies. <laughs> no, wait, that, that was another movie. Um, basically, he asks the scientists, do you not want to see this anymore? And so when the guy, when the guy says yes, the djinn steals his eyes and puts it into his own head. So it was pretty brutal. <laughs> I like the sequel too, so yeah, I, I get some scenes confused, but this film was pretty bloody, <laughs> pretty gruesome, and people make wishes because he ends up crossing paths with many people, and He grants them their wishes, and then later on he takes their souls. So, the ending is cool and awesome, and it's, the first, first sequel is good. The second sequel is, sequel is okay. Not great, but okay. And the fourth one, I've only seen bits and pieces, but... I don't think I'm gonna watch it because it just doesn't look great to me so this film I give let's see five wishes out of five wishes because it's pretty awesome alright thanks for listening to my review I'm a little tired so forgive me for my slowness Whew. hope you're all having a good day Peace.